Hey y'all, back at it again with another tutorial. I'm going to be using the crayon box in this video. If you guys want to see me turn this nay into a sleigh, continue watching. The foundation I'm using today is the Fenty Beauty in the shade 440. And I'm going to be using my Real Technique powder brush to blend it all in. up my brows I take my small little beauty blender and I put a little bit of foundation on the back of my hand I take my beauty blender dab that and I go under the eye gonna go in with my uh, MAC Pro Long Concealer in the shade NC45. I usually use about two pumps for my whole face. Sometimes more, sometimes less. And I go in with my uh, e.l.f. Angle Brush. So that way when I get my beauty, when I go in with my beauty blender, I don't have to do much but blend it all together. So I take my beauty blender and I spray a little bit of my Fix Plus. And I blend it in. <laughs> Now that I have it all blended in, I'm going to take my beauty blender and I'm going to dab it in my Ben 9 Banana Powder. So for my contour, I'm going to be using the Bobbi Brown Foundation Stick in the color Cool Espresso. For this, I only used a little bit because I like a matte finish and this is a dewy finish. So I just put a little bit on each side, dot a little bit on my forehead and two lines under my chin. And then I go in with my MAC Studio Fix in the shade NW58. I take my Real Technique brush and I blend it in.
I contour a little bit, I'll go in with a little bit of my Ben 9 Banana Powder. I go back in with that small blender. What the fuck is this? Why well, I keep forgetting this name? Um. My eyeshadow primer, I'm going to be using the Urban Decay. of crayons so I'm gonna go in with the color green and I'm gonna be using my real technique crease brush so I usually don't do this but I'm gonna put some tape on so I can get that perfect look that I am going for close to my inner tear duct. I'm trying to blend the blue and the green together so there's no harsh line. Fun fact, I just started doing my eye uh, my eyeshadows like a I used to play it safe, but I'm like, nah, I'm about to start using some color. Hey guys, this takes a long time to blend, so don't try to rush this process. Trust me, I've learned. Don't rush it. Just take your time and blend these colors together. Now, I think I want to do something crazy. Like, I want to go in with this pink. Like, I don't know. I just feel it. I feel it. Like, I think I should go in with this pink. Because I was thinking about, like, a brown or an orange. But I think I want to do something a little crazy. So I still have a little bit of my concealer. I'm going to take my small angle brush from e.l.f. And I'm going to pop it right in the middle. Alright. <laughs> I'm going to take my real technique brush. This is the the sanding brush and I'm gonna take that pink oh my gosh <laughs> oh, oh okay 
It kind of look cute. Wait, hold up, hold up, hold up. This, okay, I like it. Wow, okay. So I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go back in with that green so I can blend the pink and the green together. back in with the blue and blend the pink and the blue together comment down below and let me know what you guys think of this I think I like it. <laughs> if the tape messes up my concealer just a little bit, I go back in with my banana powder and I just fix it up. And I let that sit for a little bit. While I let the um, banana powder sit, I'll go in and put on my mascara. I use the Super Size Me by CoverGirl. I'm going to be using MAC and I'm going to be using my It's My Ray Ray, the number two brush. And I'm going to use it on the apple of my cheek. For my highlight, I'm going to be using Fenty Beauty Trophy Wife and I'm going to be using the um, It's My Ray Ray, the number five brush. Just gonna put a little bit, a little bit of this trophy wife goes a long way. I'm not gonna go OD with the highlights. I'm gonna take the It's My Ray Ray brush, the number nine excuse me, the number six brush. And I'm going to put a little bit on my nose and a little bit right between my eyes. And I'm gonna use the It's My Ray Ray, the number nine brush. I'm gonna put a little bit in between my eyes. I'm going to do hmm I think I want to should I do the pink or the green under my eye I think I'm gonna play it safe and do the green even though I really want to do the pink but I'm like scared how it's gonna turn out hmm oh well I'm just about to do it <laughs> I'm gonna go back in with that same Actually, you know what? I kind of want to use the It's My Ray Ray, the number seven brush, and I'm going to go in with that pink, and we're just going to see how it turns out. in the kiss beyond natural lashes 
for my glue I use the duo glue the dark the black whatever So if you are limited on your brushes and you need to use the same brush for different colors or different use or whatever the case may be, what I do is I go in with a little bit of alcohol, I put it on my brush, I take a napkin and I dab it on there. It sanitizes it and it gets the color off. So you have a brand new clean brush. The eyeshadow I use is e.l.f. eyeshadow pod in the color jet black. lipstick I'm gonna be using naturally transformed well excuse me Mac mm, smells so good gonna go back in with the uh, Fenty Beauty and put it on my So for my hair, I got this hair from this guy off of Instagram. His Instagram name is I am Perez. If I'm not mistaken, it's called It's My Hair Life. But if you go to his Instagram page, which I'll link it down below, he has the link in his description box. And I have a closure, a lace closure with three bundles of straight mink hair. And this was the final look. Comment down below and let me know what you guys think of this look. Comment, like, subscribe. Catch me in the next video. Peace. Why do I always get makeup right here? Like, I don't understand. So for my eyeshadow primer, I'm gonna be using the, um, so for my eyeshadow primer, so, <laughs> oh my goodness, There's, while I let, while I let, <laughs> thick, um, I have a, for my lipstick, I'm, <laughs> for my,